I gotta wonder, Dooley, I mean, El Dulio. You have my attention, not detective. How much money does doing this pay? Oh, it doesn't pay anything. Wait, what? Yep, I do it all for the thrill of the crowd. The love that they pour onto me as I smash people's faces with chairs and any other appliance that I can find around the ring. It's so invigorating, exhilarating, euphoric. You get paid a lot of money, don't you? Legally, I do not get paid any money whatsoever. They are donations from a very generous company. I'm in so much trouble from the IRS. That you are. Please help. Not unless you acknowledge me as your friend. Darn. Hey folks, it's Kikoskia here, and welcome back to Let's Play The Dark Side Detective 2, A Fumble in the Dark. And when last we left off, we haven't even got up this ladder yet. We're probably gonna have to, if we have any hope of banishing this demon. So let's go up. And s oh, there is a window. Also, a lovely night. And the moon! It's not a Dark Side Detective case if we can't look accusingly at the moon. The air up here is clear. It fills El Dulio's lungs, makes it feel young. Maybe six or seven years of age. Up here, El Dulio is a baby. I don't think seven is a baby. Compared to my actual age, that's baby. A stainless steel chimney pipe, presumably part of the boiler system. And the moon. The moon is a big fan. It comes to you most nights. Also, it is physically very big. This is true. I can see the ring from up here, and above it is the cage the Commissioner mentioned. This seems like a good time to reiterate how little Odulio is into this match idea. Indeed! Paint? That's the legal move. Okay, we can't do anything up here yet. But I'm pretty sure we'll be able to at some point. Right, before I go and distract myself any further, let's give all this merchandise to the Commissioner. Here's your crate full of missing merchandise. Great, I can bring this to the merch stall and then go see this demon fella you told me about. See if it's worth locking him in a cage with El Dulio here. Again, I wish to say this demon, he is very big. We outside El Dulio's weight range. Let's go with him. Okay, Tick Brickman's sports shorts. Sports shorts, sports shorts, sports shorts. They seem to be screaming along to the text of the screen. As usual. So, who are you? Oh, buddy. Oh, I need to get the crowd really hating these guys to impress the commissioner. Time to rile them up. Hmm. Hey, demon. This lady thinks you have nice eyes. Rude, take the compliment, fella. Sing the national anthem for us. He got the words right, but the key is all off. I disliked hearing it, and we'll judge him accordingly. Oh dear. Would you mind getting a picture taken with this man's dog? Oh please! I called him Trash Heap because he was such a fan of the sport. We're always discussing it. <coughs> hey, don't you threaten my dog like that. Boo on you! The high five for Jesus. Swipes claws. Hey, that's not how Jesus high fives. This guy's a brute. Do you want some refreshing gloop? Oh man, I just got spit washed out of my hair earlier today. Gloop sponsors Ew. He must hate Ew if he hates Gloop. And he, if he hates Ew, then we hate him. You leave my dog out of this. He can't say that about me. I feel a strong dislike towards this performer. Boo! Who does this guy think he is? Rabble, rabble. They hate this guy. You're right, kiddo. This will make us a pretty penny. The cage match is on! El Dulio is feeling a cramp, he thinks, in the pit of his stomach. Perhaps he could not go to school this day? Somebody better inspect the cage. It's been a while since it was last used. We need to get those glyphs painted on ASAP, Dooley. That we do! This is going to be great. The audience will be happy if the faces win, and this storyline will go on for ages if they lose. Win-win for me! Very clearly a demon. <gasps> My friend is angry and you're trapped in a cage with him even better! Uh, El Dulio hopes you have a plan! They hate this guy. You're right, kiddo. You see, Miss Kamish, this is what happens when you don't get any wins. That's hardly my fault now, is it, kid? I'm not a kid. I'm 19. I have a job of crippling student debt, just like everyone else in here. I demand to be treated with respect. You got me there, kiddo. Arrgh! 
I do not approve of his last minute ill prepared demonic appearances. Well, but I get paid either way. Right, nothing else there. That's all the same. Okay, we need to go up to that cage. Oh, hey, Dick Brickman. You're on Dick Brickman Sports Shorts featuring me, Dick Brickman, asking you, not Dick Brickmans, about their upcoming matches this evening in short intervals. Have you anything you want to share with the fans? My fans. The Brickman. Il Dulio wishes to... Sorry, that's all we have time for. It's not called Dick Brickman's Life Stories. Oh. Okay. Ooh, the backdrop. What is this? Dick Brickman's Backdrop Bands. Bands. Short for banners. Is it, though? It is if you want the rhyme to work. Fair enough. Right, let's go outside. And up. And paint. And we can't do anything... Hmm. Oh, hang on. I need you to hold me over the edge. We need a way to actually go down. What? Why would I do this? I need to get to the cage to paint it in order to defeat that demon. Your plan makes no sense to Aldulio, but this demon, he is very big, and Aldulio will take all the help he can get. All right. Let us get to the business at hand. Aldulio does not wish to stand here dangling rope all night. Well, down I go. Why? Why am I doing this again? I don't know! There's, a, there's the cage. Just need to paint the runes from this book on there, and I can trap a demon inside. Please tell me you have the paint. You have the paint, yes? I do. Good. All right, paint, cage. Hurry up down there! It won't take long. I've had a lot of practice. In fact, who wants to watch paint dry? Let's just gloss over it. There we go. Sports fans, it's time for the main event! Finish just in time. We better get down there. If you take your time there, El Julio's not in a rush anymore! Well, that's all good. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. The evening's main event. The Overgiver and his very large demonic ally versus El Dulio and Senior Dectivo. The cage is down. Distract those guys while I get the crowd chanting. I, I'm thinking of retiring. I can do this before the match, see? There goes the bell! Now is the time to fight, my friend. Well, this is all good. Uh, today is taking a dark turn for El Dulio. This is it, my friend. Our night. The fight of our lives. I can feel the great inspector in the sky smiling down on us right now. I wish I had your enthusiasm. I feel like I should break this up. It's it's unfair. Ha ha ha. Eat my demon dust, loser! <laughs> well, this is awkward. This is gonna be great! It's not gonna be great for Dooley unless we do something. And I know what we need to do. Remember when the commissioner mentioned about programming the Jumbotron from here. This is where the big screen is programmed. Now to get it to say what I want. And we know the password. Looks like I need to figure out the commission's PIN number. So the PIN number was on the calendar. And it is... 16... 7... 27... 3. Yes, I'm in! Right, I just need to have to input the demon's name to get the audience to shout it and banish him. If only I knew it. Hmm. Let's think here. We don't know his name. Hang on! I think I know what I need to do. If I escape, I guess I need to look out for the demon's name. If I... The only thing I have left of the 3D glasses. Let's see what we can see. Looks like I can make out hidden message in the page. Ah! So the demon's name is Bupo? Chilling stuff. Well, figured it out! Okay. So we need Bupo. Right, just need to input the demon's name, get the audience to shout it, and banish him. We need Bupo. Okay, this is... Rotating round, so we need Bupo. There is a U there. There we go. That's it. Now to get back to the ring. That was surprisingly easy. Also, Bupo is right there. Dectibo is down, and the big guy has Aldulio in a death grip. 
It looks like it's lights out for those guys. Boo po, boo po, boo po. Even the crowd is chanting for the bad guys now. Whoa! -oh. What? No! Thank the gods! It looks like the Overgiver's new friend vanished as quickly as he appeared. Aldurio has him pinned. No, wait, Ref! You said you didn't allow two or more matches. That's true. I did say that. Ha! I, I forfeit. It is just the two of you, again. Oh, prepare to lose, Bipara. One, two, three. Yay! It's not fair. Life's not fair. Book him, Dooley. Sorry, I'm late, Detective. Norman's hot dog store was on the tracks, and by the tracks, they be near them. Wait! The... What? It's not for hot dogs, that's what I'm saying. Dooley, but if you're you, then who is old Dulio? And why did you want me to meet you here? I thought it was to show me your secret life as a wrestler. What? That stuff's way too dangerous for me. I brought you here because I wanted to show you this wrestler I look like. Jaipen, we're like twins, detective. I think I'm gonna sue for likeness rights. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting him to not, in fact, be Dooley. Well, don't I feel silly now? A rundown wrestler tried to win a championship with a demonic ally, but I put the supernatural smackdown on their plans. And now, Class of the Titans. A high school re- Oh, no. A high school reunion? Oh, this is not gonna end well. Let's go! Twin Lakes High School. Oh, so you're a detective now? Just like McKing, eh? No, not like McKing. Well, sort of like McKing. The same, but different, you know? Yeah, I getcha. Cool. He inspired you. You followed him into the force and now work under him, right? Like a mentee? Am I picking you up correctly? I want to go now, Dooley. Well, this isn't going well. The banner is put down to manage students' expectations. Oh dear. What a beautiful light display. Don't stare, Detective. I'm pretty sure they've already abducted at least three past students. We have lots of people we can talk to, like Dooley. You wore your uniform? How else will people know about my sidekick as a private dancer? Gotta get those clients somehow. Oh, me? After high school, I founded a new country. A little place called New Atlantis. New Atlantis? Oh yes, a wondrous new land where humankind is free to explore the full scope of science and morality untethered. Look, Gabby, we all know you drunkenly sank a cruise ship and had your rich dad cover it up. New Atlantis, pfft, you fooled nobody. Hey, Jonathan. And then I invested in all sorts of stocks. Beef-flavored chicken, fish too. And yeah, so now I'm a bullionaire. Ha <laughs> ha, get it. I run an adult store now. An adult store like? Yeah, exactly like that. And we pride ourselves on stocking it all. Old, young, man, woman, NB, regular, boring adults like accountants, weird adults who never fitted in, adults who are sort of still kids. Every kind of grown-up you could want to hang out with. Oh, a store for renting actual adults. Whew, that's the one. You can rent them by the hour, day, week, or longer, or even purchase an adult. But you have to pass a background check, of course. You can't just go letting adults out into the wild unsupervised. I have several questions about the purchasing part. So does the government. Yep, he's asleep. Professor Time Loop, I haven't seen you in years. You look exactly the same. Haha, <laughs> what even is time? But seriously, it's only been, what, two years? Three? Uh, something like that. Maybe a little longer. A smidge. I've never been good at reading ages. It's the lack of facial features. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh! What was all that? Gas? You think the entire building shook from somebody passing gas? Collective gas? Enough to rock an entire building? Maybe? Well, just in case it's not gas. Just in case, mind you, we should get to the roof and look around, see if we can spot anything strange. Oh gosh, I hope Detective McKing is okay. You would hope that. Right. To the stage. We should get to the roof and see what's causing those quakes. There it is again. This just in, the sky is falling. Oh, Dick Brickman. 
I want you to know that my TLH tattoo stands for Twin Lakes Heroes, which is me. It was awarded to me by Emily for granting her a tattoo gun. Nothing to do with this place. Ugh. Well, let's look around. Do these look like police car lights to you? Why? Do you think the cops are under us? Quick, what are this? Th th nobody. No. Has it really been that long? The class of 19... I like it. I like it. Oh, our old yearbook. Don't make me be the... Don't we have a case to solve guy? Just one second. Ah! We have Kingsley McKing. Voted most likely. Figures. Sean Dolan. Voted most likely to work for the man. Oh, very good. Very clever. I see, I see. What? Work for the man. The man. Demand. Demons. Scare works for demons. That's a leap, Dolium, for you. <laughs> hmm. See, I told you. Oh, yeah, the kid with the beard. Why isn't he here? He was Benjamin buttoning it. He's only about four months old now. Yeah, that explains it. Voted most likely to end TV. End up working in, surely? Nope, don't you remember the fire? Oh, yes. Oh. Francis McQueen. Voted most likely to read the yearbook comments at our reunion. Oh. Yeah, they showed you! Voted most likely to need rescuing from sinister parallel dimension. <laughs> As if. D Dooley. That literally happened. As if. Fed McSurname. Voted most likely to regret coming back to the reunion. They may be important to the case. Probably not, though. Ben DeHammerson. Most likely to have peed in the punch. This was written today. And signed. By Bender. I'm glad I didn't drink the punch. What? You saying something about the punch? Dude, you're drinking the punch right now. Yep, and it's... Oh, no. Voted most likely to turn to the dark side. We should maybe look her up and make sure she's not overthrowing something somewhere. Voted most likely to be an imaginary boy. Hey! Dog and a cat. I didn't know that cat had a name. Or that she was a student here. Most likely to steal his daddy's heart. Oh No, there's more. And buried in the backyard. It's still sort of cute. It really isn't. Oh, there's so many names here. Ah! Marshall Bassett's here. Voted most likely to be the soup king of Twin Lakes. Ooh, it was so close. Lake Killibus. I didn't go to that school. Stop taking my photo. Mr. Mountain Berlin. Voted most likely to be killed in a summoning. Hey, I remember that case. Dennis Williams. Now I understand why Dennis always wanted to grow up and work in the adult industry. That turned out to be way more wholesome than I thought of a time. There's Whitney Bargeman. Go Goatman. Joe Spagnuolo. Most likely to get arrested for smashing pumpkins. Ruth Newman. Most likely to put a fish in the percolator. Michaela Williams. I'll land that pyramid, even if it kills you all and ends the universe. Ophelia? Voted most driven to end up married to Kingsley, at any cost. Get in line, sister. Dooley? What? His hair is so luxurious. There's, a uh, Kittinger? Most likely to write a fantasy novel. Marshall Bearsom. Hmm, this has been scrawled in since. Voted most likely to be a normal human person. Oh man, I was convinced I'd win that vote. But you didn't. Most likely to establish an underwater utopia. Don't you dare finish that sentence! Next page. Oh, there are more. Laura Thompson. We went to school with a lot of animals. The school had to make up class numbers to get federal grants. There's candies. I'm coming back for that crown. You mark my words. Mark them. And there's Yolanda. I'd be cuter in a higher resolution. Wouldn't we all? Voted most likely to be indecisive. Maybe. There's Braugen Ardito. Help, they took my photo and I've been trapped in here ever since. Is that a joke or a case? I can't tell anymore. Probably both. There's Alex. I'd have had a beautiful voice if the devs weren't so cheap. But they were cheap. So cheap. Zero, zero, one, one, one. Oh, oh, that's a lot of binary. That's a lot of binary. Man, I miss Robot Kid. I am not translating that. So, I can just put whatever I want here, right? <laughs> and they did. Victoria Sponge. 
get that camera out of my face or else. So dreamy. I get the reference. Purity sin. In hindsight, we should have known Miss Kit was different. I just thought they were a transfer student. From somewhere else? There's Niall. My mom told me I have a face for pixels. And Hunter Chops. When I grow up, I'm going to sue you all for teasing me. Oh boy, did he sue me. I'm still making the payments to this day. Well, that was a big waste of time. The world's been destroyed since you were gawking at that book. Really? No, but I did scare you for a moment. Really, if the world had ended, we'd have known. Not if you were in a protective Dick Brickman bubble of time. Wait, those exist? No. But I had you thinking it for a moment, didn't I? No, not really. Dick Brickman really needs to work on his improv. And when we come back, folks, something terrible is going on. I'm going to guess Titans are trying to take over everything. Because that's what they do. Because of course that's what they do. And when we come back, we'll deal with it. Also, there's a crack in the wall. Ah, oh, this school's falling apart. Just like your life, Detective. That was really deep. Was it really? If I say it, it might be. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not. And if you are subscribed, press that bell for those notifications. And I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later.